Freezing temperatures are taking a toll on East Texas farmers. For local peach orchards, it's all hands on deck right now. As KETK's Olivia Sandusky shows us, they're trying everything they can to protect their early buds from freezing and dying. That middle guy there, that the middle clear. For the Sattlers, peach growing is a family business. So we planted these trees in 07, and so we've been pretty invested um, as a family unit in the success of the orchard. And the industry is very dependent on weather. In the orchard, we need about 800 hours or 900 hours of chill during the winter, and that's 45 degrees or lower. And for peach trees, including the June gold, each one of these small pink blooms will turn into a fully developed fruit if the temperature stays above 28 degrees, causing farmers to be concerned as this cold front heads into East Texas. While the 20 degree temperatures are unseasonable, the blooms are out of place as well. You know, typically the orchard will start to bloom about March 15th, but this particular variety, which is called June Gold, bloomed almost at uh, Valentine's Day, so we're way early. So their son came home from Texas A&M this weekend to help prepare for the freeze. What we'll uh, attempt to do is spray a product called Vapor Guard, and that basically encapsulates the bloom and protects it. Uh, maybe not down to 25, but you know, better than doing nothing. They'll also burn wood and use fans to keep the heat down in the orchard. We do have skin in the game, um, financially and emotionally. So we would really like to have a, a positive um, turnaround for this, as opposed to losing this entire crop of June gold. To have a solid start to the main selling season, Olivia Sandusky, KETK News.